of all, I would like to explain you about you know tenses in Thai language. Basically, some of Thai people say in Thai language there are no tenses, which is actually wrong because we still talk about past, present, and future. But the thing is, in Thai language. There are no conjugations, so congratulations! You don't have to learn all of the, you know, conjugation like in English when you say eat, eating, eaten. No, but we have some words that define the tenses. In this lesson, you're gonna learn together. Believe me, it's not too hard. Let's start. Rub gun. All right. Let's start with the first one. First type of sentence statement. Basically, there are two tense determinator. The first one is gamlang plus verb or you at the end. So if you see the word gamlang or you, you know that people are talking about right now. Present continuous tense for the first one. Subject, gamlang plus verb and object. For example, pom gamlang tham ngan. So look at this, pom, I for men, gamlang tham ngan. So I, what is the word tham ngan? Tham ngan we just learn is to work, right? So tham ngan is to work. So, but the thing is, you have the word gam lang, which is the tense terminator. I will put it here, so you know that I or the person that are speaking is working. So not only work but working because of the word gam lang. So in this case, the sentence pom gam lang tham ngan is I am working. Make sense. Because of the word "gamlang," all right. Next one, เขาไป sorry, เขากำลังไปซื้อของ Look, you see the word "gamlang" again. So here, "gamlang," and the verb is "ไปซื้อของ Here, so เขากำลังไปซื้อของ means เขา is he or she. "Gamlang" is you know definitely person. Is definitely present continuous tense. Buy s u k o n g is going to what s u k o n g to buy stuff or to shop. So he or she is going to buy stuff or to shop, right? So he is going to shop. Is เขากำลังไปซื้อของ See, makes sense with the word กำลัง If you put กำลัง plus verb, you know that it's Present continuous tense, talking about now, right now. The second way to say is you at the end of the sentence. So you at the end of the sentence. For example, สุดาเรียนภาษาไทย you. Look at this. You see something? You at the end. See, สุดาเรียนภาษาไทย you. The verb is. เรียนภาษาไทย So basically, what what is it? สุดาเรียนภาษาไทยอยู่สุดา is what? เรียนภาษาไทย Learning Thai. That's it. Because the word you tell you that it's you know present continuous tense. The next one. แซมกินข้าวอยู่ Ah, again the word you at the end. So you know it's present continuous. And กินข้าว is the verb. So what does it mean? Sam กินข้าวอยู่ Basically, Sam is what กินข้าว eating or having a meal. That's it. All right. Just one thing. Don't get confused the word you because we just learned the word you can be first one. Verb to be to locate right. For example. ฉันอยู่ที่บ้าน I am at home. ฉันอยู่ที่บ้าน In this case, it's a verb to be. So you is here. You know, act as a verb. Use as a verb. Why the second one? You as the present con determinator word. นะฮะ But it put at the end 
of the sentence. For example, sorry, let's put it here. For example, ฉันกินข้าวอยู่ What does it mean? ฉันกินข้าวอยู่ is look ฉัน I กินข้าว have a meal อยู่ at the end is a present continuous tense so I am eating so don't get confused นะคะอยู่ to think verb to be it should be at the beginning as a verb or if you at the end of a sentence then you talking about Present continuous tense or right now, okay? Or last way to say for the statement, you can use both กำลัง and you กำลัง past verb and you at the end. If you use กำลัง and you together, you really emphasize that it's right now, doing it right now. For example, พวกเขากำลังมีประชุมอยู่ See, both กำลัง and you, and the verb is มีประชุม which is To have a meeting, right? To have a meeting. So what does it mean? พวก sorry, พวกเราอะพวกเรากำลังมีประชุมอยู่ So พวกเรา is we are definitely having a meeting. Yes, right now, and you know, and you know, really telling about time. For example, if somebody is like, "Hello." Hello, when you are you know in the meeting and you're like, hey, I'm sorry, but พวกเรากำลังมีประชุมอยู่ We are really having a meeting right now, so don't do it. Don't talk to me for now. I'm busy. Something like this. Okay. The second type of the sentence is negative. So definitely, you should have the negation determinator, which is my. All right, and you have the word "you" to tell that you are talking about present continuous tense. The thing is, if you want to make it negative, you have to say "my die, my die" plus "you" at the end of the sentence. For example, ฉันไม่ได้ดูหนังอยู่ Look, you see, "my die" and "you." So, basically, what does it mean? I am not ดูหนัง What does it mean? ดูหนัง Do n a n g is to watch a movie. Remember, we just learned it. So, I am not watching a movie. Right? ฉันไม่ได้ดูหนังอยู่ Not watching a movie. All right. The second um, example. คุณมานีไม่ได้ไปทำงาน Look. You actually, should put the word "you" at the end. So basically, look at this. คุณมานีไม่ได้ negative ไปทำงานอยู่ See the word "you" at the end. So you know it's present continuous tense. So what does it mean in this case? Look, คุณมานีไม่ได้ไปทำงานอยู่คุณมานีคุณมานี what? ไม่ได้ไปทำงาน is not ไปทำงาน is what going to work. See, that's it. So it's a negative sentence of present continuous tense. You need to put the word you at the end to tell it's right now. Okay. The last example. เขาไม่ได้มีประชุมอยู่ means he or she. So he or she. Remember, ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ is not. มีประชุม is to have a meeting and you at the end till that right now so he or she is not having a ประชุม is meeting so he or she is not having a meeting เขาไม่ได้มีประชุมอยู่ that's it put the word ไม่ได้ as negative and put the word you at the end of the sentence to show that it's a present continuous tense all right good And the last type of the sentence structure is question. And now you're gonna learn how to ask a question for present continuous tense. So basically, you really need กำลังอ r you at the end of the sentence. But what you need to make it question is question word. You see, question word, question word, and question word. 
Just only look at this part. If it yes no question, for example, the word mai, che mai, or che mai not che mai, che mai or ru or ro like this, you put the question word at the end. Why if it the question word like the word arai, what, ti nai. Where you put it before the word you, so just a little bit different นะคะ structure. Let's start with the first one. You use the word gamlang to tell present continuous tense and question word at the end to tell it's a question. Look, คุณกำลังทำอะไร You see this? The word gamlang is telling is right now. ทำอะไร And the word อะไร is a question would mean what? So basically, what does it mean? คุณ you are กำลังทำอะไรทำ is doing what so basically what are you doing see easy very good next the word you we use the word you at the end and yes no question word so คุณกินข้าวอยู่หรอ look at this กินข้าว is a verb right and then you here you go to tell the present continuous tense And raw is question word. So sorry, question word. So basically, you say Kun, you are kin kao, kin kao, eating. You raw. Hmm. So basically, are you eating or are you having a meal? So that's it. All right. And last one. Let's do this one. คุณกินอะไรอยู่ Look at this. The word อะไร is question word, and you put the word you at the end, so you know it's a present continuous. So basically, คุณ you กิน eat อะไร what, and you put the word you, so you know it's present continuous tense. So all together, คุณกินอะไรอยู่ means what are you eating? See, that's it. So, คุณกำลังทำอะไร You are doing what or what are you doing? คุณกินข้าวอยู่หรอ You having meal hmm? or basically, are you having a meal or are you eating? And last one, คุณกินอะไรอยู่ You eat what right now? So basically, what are you eating? That's it. So now let's see some example. What are they doing? The word day is. พวกเขา but you want to emphasize on present continuous tense so you need the word กำลัง see พวกเขากำลัง doing ทำอะไร see ทำอะไร what doing what so พวกเขากำลังทำอะไร what are they doing next one the answer is look they are having a meeting right so they are having a meeting they are so พวกเขา Are having you need the word กำลัง to tell that it's right now having a meeting in Thai language is to have มี a meeting is ประชุม so พวกเขากำลังมีประชุม they are having a meeting next example is he watching a movie look at this this guy is he watching a movie so is he watching a movie subject come first so เขา you see เขา Watching a movie. What is the word? Watch a movie is do nang. So, kau do nang, and you put the word you to tell it's you know present continuous tense, and you have the word ra, which is question word. So basically, he watching a movie, huh? So basically, is he watching a movie? And the answer is no, no. My Thai, no. He is not watching a movie. So, เขาไม่ได้ดูหนังอยู่ You know why? Because the word ไม่ได้ is negation. So negative. See, ไม่ได้ดูหนังอยู่ You have to put you at the end to tell his continuous tense. So basically, he is not watching a movie. So he is reading a book. So he is reading a book. What would you say? He, k a o g a m l a n g Reading a book is remember, and book is nang. 
สือ so เขากำลังอ่านหนังสือ or you can use you so เขาอ่านหนังสือ and you at the end so that's it and the last example what is the kid doing what is the kid doing subject come first the kid kid in Thai language is t h e k right so d e k doing ทำ doing what ทำอะไรอยู่ you see you have question word อะไร here and you have the tense determinator you at the end so basically the kid d e c k doing what right now so what is the kid doing the answer is she is sleeping the word sleep is what sleep is non right non so she is sleeping subject come first she เขา is sleeping กำลังนอนอยู่กำลัง and you at the end so she is right now sleeping that's it alright so you already learned the present continuous tense let me review for a little bit so you have two type of present continuous tense word the first one กำลัง plus verb the second one is you at the end of the sentence if you make it a negative you have to use the word ไม่ได้ to say is not All right, and then put the word you at the end. Or question, use either กำลัง plus verb or you at the end, and then put the question word also at the end. That's it.